you hey, practice on your shot, you get, you got, it's going to come to the light. He'd really been struggling, and I think Coach Payne said that uh, on the radio that he had some self doubt. How he did? I just self confidence from his jump shot. Now he got it back, so now we can we can we can move on with this now. But well, Kevin said that you guys had a players only meeting. Did that, how did that help you guys? Oh, it helped us very well. It helped us a lot. Really. And everybody had we one in each other. We had our own rules there. So when when Kyle had our own rules too, it was just. It was, it's just brighten our day up because we already knew what we wanted to do from the beginning before we had that meeting. When did you have the meeting? Uh, I don't know, maybe the day. This week, last week, week no, it, was a, it was like a minute. It was like after that second, that third or second loss we had. Players only me, so. Everybody and what kinda, went on? Everybody kind of cleared the air. Everybody cleared the air. Everybody had to say what they had to say. We had to fix everything we had to do, and we did it. I saw you smiling out on the board, talking to Fonzo a little bit. It uh -huh. seems like you guys are having fun right now. Oh, yeah, you're competing, really. He, he like he like competing. I like competing. We like talking trash, and, and that's what we do. <laughs> Quite a, it seems like you and Shay have really found a good balance of handling the ball and running the point between yeah. the two of you. Do you feel like that that's something that's happened in the last few games? Oh yeah, I think that I think that's more of an adjustment me and him had to do really. Mm -hmm. When when not to get the ball up, trust each other with the ball. So that's really uh, that's what we, our, our adjustments really had to do. But a two scoreless eighty points, three straight games. What is the biggest change? Team score is 84 kills in three straight games. What is the biggest change? Everybody playing up each other. Everybody scoring the ball. That's all that is. How much do you think shooting is contagious? Yeah, uh, when, once, once Hami got going, everybody started getting game going, so we was happy about that. Missouri coach talked a lot about your aggressiveness, your toughness tonight. Did you feel like that was different tonight as opposed to other games? Oh, uh, this this was a payback game. We we owed them because they, they spanked us. Well, I won't say spanked us. They beat us really bad, and we had a bad game, so we had to come back and spank them tonight. Right. Did you all talk about that motivation going into the game, that revenge factor? Oh yeah, we, this is on our, this is on them. Uh, we since after we lost, we knew we were gonna play them again, so that's where we was gonna get them. Quaddy, I noticed your your defense has improved tremendously yeah. recently. Could you talk a little bit about that? I've been working on it, working on having have a defensive confidence. Really. Yeah, that's all I've been having. Embracing, <laughs> embracing the confidence. That's all. Cal talked a lot about Shea's uh, work ethic going into these last couple of weeks, mm -hmm. coming in early, staying late. Have you seen that spread throughout the rest of the team since yeah, Cal talked to you all working. about that? Everybody. Just not Shea. Everybody been working. Everybody waking up in the morning, lifting, shooting, coming at night, shooting. And getting, you get a proper sleep. Everybody doing they supposed to do the class. And all the little stuff going to add up. And that's what it, that's what it's doing. How much do you like when you have a family here like you did tonight watching you play? I love it. It's like I'm at home again. I mean, you kind of glance up there every yeah, now and then during the, the game, don't you? Yeah, I, I love it. I love my, my mom, my, my, my dad, and my cousins, and my sisters here. I love it.